We're all going on a summer holiday. We'll be going for a week or two. What is up, people? Dobson Willis right here. I do apologize about that. Now, as you guys may know, I put up a, put up a poll. You guys picked, of course, the top 10 games that you wanted, that you would never see on my channel. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. But I thought to make these others and put them up on the channel quite randomly because I thought you guys deserve it. Now this video is pretty much what countries would I want to go to in the near future? Now let me tell you truthfully right now. The countries that I've already been to and I still remember them in my head very, very well. I've been to France, aka Paris. I've been to Tokyo, Japan and all of the rest of Japan. So you get my drift there. I've been to Greece. I've been to the Dominican Republic. And I have been nowhere else except for, as you guys know, Wales, Scotland, Ireland, you get the gist of it. Pretty much the whole United Kingdom. But a part of me always says to myself, Dobsey, what countries would you want to go to before your final curtain call? Pretty much before you die. Or pretty much as your bucket list. So I thought to myself, that's a very good question for myself. So I'm thinking, what other countries would I want to go to? When I get older, or next year, or anytime I feel like it, whether I'm with on my own, or with friends, or with family. So this is my, pretty much I picked 10, okay? They're not ranked up on where, because they're all pretty much neutral to me, because I don't know what the experience will be when I'm going there. So I'm going to go ahead and just say them randomly as ever. So the first country I was really wanted to go to was St. Lucia. Now, St. Lucia, once again, it's a nice tropical uh, island and everything. It's like, um, it's like, um... It's like Dominican Republic, but the main thing, the reason why I wanted to go there is because there's two reasons. Number one, it's the place that my mum and dad got married in. They married, they got, they went there. And they also had the honeymoon there. My brothers went there. We, they pretty much had an amazing time there. And I saw the pictures and I've seen the video clips of it and I find it so, so relaxing and so nice. Now there is a main reason about this though. The way they had the wedding and everything, it's no longer there. But there is one thing that's there, and that's the Hotel Chocolate Hotel. The best Hotel Chocolate Hotel in the world. But the price of that hotel is extravagantly expensive. If I had the money, I'd go there and check it out for myself because it's the place where they grow the chocolate, where they grow the cacao. I'd love to see that. It'd be one hell of an experience. And you guys know how much I like hotel chocolate. Their products, their chocolate is amazing. It's super delicate, it's super delicate and it's sweet and it sometimes can be very bitter, but it's so nice and indulgent. So I'd love to go to St. Lucia just to see that, but also have a nice relaxation of a holiday. A nice relaxation holiday like that, like I did with Dominican Republic. The other countries I like to go in, pretty much a lot of people have gone to this place, but I've never been to, and that's Amsterdam. Amsterdam is something like a part of me wants to go, but a part of me doesn't really want to go. Because you have myself, the party guy, who wants to go there and have a lot of fun, then you have the one who likes to sightsee, and I thought to myself, there's not a lot of places to really see in Amsterdam. It's mainly a place where people like to go out clubbing, drinking, and causing trouble. That's partially true. <laughs> but... A lot of my friends said to me, you should go there, do it for a vlog, it'd be a lot of fun. I thought to myself, it could be a good idea, and it's quite cheap. So maybe I might go there in the near future, maybe with Beth, or CJ, or Johnny, or somebody else, or even with a family member, you don't know. But I'd like to go there one day, that'd be cool. Maybe for a weekend, you don't know. A weekend vlog in another country, that'd be cool, that'd be quite funny too. The next place I want to go to is Canada. Oh, Canada. Now, Canada is something special as well because Toronto, Canada, I would love to go to Toronto. I really do. And it's just... It's just something there. I just like the look of the place. I do like Canada. There is other places in Canada that I love to go and see, but Toronto is the one I really, really, really want to go and have a look at. And there's possibly a lot, a lot of good stuff over there. The restaurants there are possibly really nice, and uh, the side scene is really nice. And there possibly be some great places there for retro games and everything. So I thought to myself, maybe I might have myself to stop off there to get some games. But like I said, it's mainly for my own get personal gain and my own way of collecting stuff. But I've also watched other YouTubers that I watch, like Dude Where's My Challenge, who goes there, and uh, yeah, it looks like a fun place to go. It looks like America, but it's not. <laughs> 
So that's why we went. I went to go to Canada because it looks like a nice place to go to. A lot of people may disagree with me, but I've never been to Canada, so I'd love to go there myself. Uh, next country I want to go to, I want to go to Australia. Welcome to the land down under. Yeah, when I'm gonna sit under. Now, now pretty much Australia, I like Sydney. I like really love to go to Sydney. I actually have a friend who actually lives there, and it's like probably go there and see her, or just just take a lot of friends with me and have a fun time there. Australia is something different though, because it's like. It's hot and it can be relaxing, but also it can also be very much adventurous because there's there's also the, the um, forests and everything that the the big massive rainforests. I'd love to try and check that out, but there's so much stuff to do there in Australia. It really is. You can go and see like the big massive deserts or the jungles or the cities, the sea life and everything. I'd love it. I would think it'd be awesome. I think also there as well, swimming with dolphins, that'd be awesome to, to do there too, that'd be nice. But besides that though, I'd have Australia to be another place I'd like to go on the holiday one day. The next place I want to go to, now pretty much get your maths prepared, China. Now China, I am not saying that don't go there. Probably go there in a few years time, defo. But you may be thinking, Dobsey, why the hell do you want to go to China for some reason? I want to go and see the Great Walls of China. I really do. I want to walk the whole thing. <laughs> I don't care if I need a bike or a car. I'll just do the whole thing. Carl Pilkington did it and I want to do the same thing he did. I just want to see the Great Walls of China. Pretty much. That's what I really want to do. There is other things I want to check out. But the main things I don't want to check out. I don't want to see on the channel. Because I do not want to get demonetized. I'm just saying things. You know. Stay away from the stuff the sea virus and the places that it's been to. So that's all I'm saying for about China. When I see the Great Walls of China and look at some of their sites and their amazing temples. The next one I want to go to, I want to go to the beautiful Italy. Oh my god, Italy. Now that is a country I love to go to. Like the, the Tower of Pisa. The, the, oh, the, the country to me, it sounds beautiful. The name, Italy, the colour of the flag is beautiful, but even watching documentaries and even watching cooking shows of people going to Italy, I think it looks fabulous, to be honest. It looks like a nice place to go. Sitting there on your patio, in your hotel, drinking red wine, eating cheese and olives. I don't like olives, but I'll eat the cheese. Having a swell time. I think it'd be amazing, to be honest. And I, there's lots of things to go and have a look there. So I'd love to go and check out Italy myself. The next place I want to go to, this is pretty much the reason why I think it's funny to go to with a lot of my friends, and that's Benidorm. <laughs> right, Benidorm. Right, when I was a kid, I never wanted to go to Benidorm, but after watching the side men do the um, the money, um, the um, that's what I think it was like a hundred pound holiday versus the ten thousand dollar ho holiday. And you had Ethan and Ethan, Vic and um, Simon going to Benidorm. I think it was a hell of a route. I think it was awesome. A whole weekend, pub crawl, and seeing all them weird freaking shows. I'm not going to explain everything about it because I don't want you guys to research it. So yeah, if you guys want to know what they are, go and look at the Sidemen video because there is some stuff that they went to saw and I thought to myself it would be funny to see that with a lot of my mates. It'd be one hell of a funny night to go there for a weekend. Definitely not for a week, but definitely for a weekend. So yeah, Benidorm, I'd love to go and check that out, have a bit of a laugh. It'd be, a, it'd be probably a good vlogging um, session to do that. The next country I want to go to, I want to go to South Korea. I would love to check out South Korea. I am not talking about North Korea because I do not want to step foot in that place, but South Korea, I've heard a lot of great things about that place. And the food, the, the lighting of the place. I've seen pictures of somebody on top of a balcony looking at the city in South Korea and it looks unbelievable. I thought to myself, wow, what a place. I want to check that out. And I've heard that the street life there as well at night time and including in the daytime 
things to do, bit of fun and everything. The clubs, I've heard everything about it is absolutely off the charts. So I thought to myself, why not? Probably one day I might go there. I'd love to check out South Korea. Probably shout out to the fans who live in South Korea. Much love to you all. The next countries I want to go to is the US of A. Okay, America. It's an obvious thing. I've never been to America, okay? But there is, there is a lot of states in America, so I'm going to just jot them down really quick on what they're all going to be. Main one, Las Vegas. I want to go there. I want to see Penn and Teller. I want to see the great celebs there. I want to have fun. There's so much stuff to do there. There's the amazing Hall of Fame gumball place. There's, of course, the casinos. I like to have a bit of fun there. Not win any money, of course, because I'm shit at gambling. But mainly in the scene of the show is the amazing restaurants. Hell's Kitchen's there as well, I've heard. Um, one of Gordon Ramsay's new restaurants. There's just so much stuff, but I definitely want to check out Caesar's Palace. Oh my god. That, that's one of the casino places I've wanted to look at for many years. The other, the other part of America, I want to go and check out Texas. Love the look of Texas. I just love the cowboy stuff. I have to go there, dress up as a cowboy. Yeah! We live one of my classic childhood lives. Uh, the other place I want to go to, the good old Big Apple, New York City. Love to go there. Maybe for Christmas. I'd love to go that Christmas. It'd be like Home Alone, number two. Oh yes, that'd be awesome. And the other one, I want to go to Florida. Of course, the new, the good old classic Florida. You can't go wrong. Definitely would love to check that out. Sunny beaches, great places to look at. And a lot of great shopping there too. And the other one, of course... LA, Los Angeles, mainly Hollywood mainly because I just want to check it out, I really do. I know a lot of people are saying that Hollywood is just a massive trap for a lot of, ter for a lot of, um, for a lot of um, you know, foreigners, and people who want to come and visit the country. I just really want to check it out, I really do. I don't care if I don't see any celebrities, I really don't care. It'd be awesome, it'd be a massive Brucey bonus if I see them, but... I just like to look at it. I just want to literally have a good picture of myself behind the Hollywood sign. I would really love to do it. I could definitely do it with my green screen if I really want to, but that's cheating. <laughs> Anyhow, so that's what I want to do for USA. Now, any other country as well, if I didn't say any other names out, there's just so many of them, but they're my, like, my top ones I want to go to. The last country though, I know you may be thinking, that your last country now is up? So why about Russia and all them lot? It's, it's, they're low in my tier, but these are my main ones I want to go to. My last country I definitely would want to go and probably my, my next destination I might go to after I go back to Japan. Maybe. And that's Thailand. I want to go to Thailand. If you, if you guys saw my oh, uh, one of my videos last year, me singing Pattaya, well, not singing it, lip syncing it, I was having one hell of a route, even, even though I was not even in the video. <laughs> that country is amazing by the look of it. The land of a million smiles. I know a lot of people thinking, obviously, do you know what they do in Thailand? You'll never go back. True. But I love to look at the beaches. The nightlife looks amazing. And definitely, I would definitely, 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 definitely take Beth from there. <laughs> uh, she could go ahead and get herself a girlfriend there easily. <laughs> I can watch that enjoy myself. But besides that, Thailand looks like a place to have amazing cuisine, amazing nightlife, and I'm sure there's a lot of stuff to do there, definitely. So I definitely would love to go to Thailand one day over there. But that's pretty much all I have to really say about my countries. Now, I know a lot of people may be thinking, what about Germany? What about Russia? What about, what about um, the Philippines? What about any of them lot? Uh, yeah, I'd like to go there, but they're not my top tier ones to go to. They're my top ones because I really am interested in them. Them ones are like, I'm not sure yet. I need to research a bit more before I do go. But them ones I've been researching a lot and yeah, I'd love to check them out. But anyhow, that's all I got time for today, people. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and hit the bell icon to get yourself another game where we're uploading and live streaming. With that being said, the people on Sligo see you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Peace, peace.